you know, women want men to make the first move. But now you can be reported to, you know, the HR department for subjecting a colleague to unwanted attention. So, you know, this myth of misogyny, this this attempt to portray men as oppressing women and women as victims, you know, it creates jobs for the HR people and the diversity industry, but it really is poisoning relations between the sexes. And, and you know, it's demoralizing and demeaning both sexes. I mean, you're penalizing hardworking men who don't get, you know, adequate rewarded for their achievements. They don't get the promotions, the awards. And you're telling women, you know, you're discouraging women by by telling them, oh, you're going to face so much discrimination and basically encouraging them to wallow in this imagined victimhood. So, you know, it's enormously costly to both sexes.